Hey guys, it's Erica. We are going to be checking out Wanna's Wolhami in. Did I say that right? Luna Dance Practice. I should just stick to English at this point. Very excited to be seeing the choreography for this because I've always loved their choreography. And stuff in the music video was choreography heavy, had a lot of cool stuff happening for it. The simple sets were really nice, the outfits were on point and stuff. So, very excited. Excuse me. Very excited to be checking this out and seeing what it is all going to be and seeing the, the full choreography. Um, so let's not waste any more of your time and you know where to let go. And the fans. How could we forget about the fans? Very cool. Oh, pretty. Jesus Christ. It's like the second choreography where we've seen fans used in this way. Okay, well there's books of Shangri-La. Kingdom's Karma, that was gorgeous. Oh, that job. He got air, girl. They're the basketball court? <laughs> Ooh. Yes. Very clean movements. Has the elegance to it, the gracefulness. And then we got rid of the fans? Okay. They catch air, bro. Nice. Down and up. And then the female dancers come back with their fans. Ooh, pretty. And the fans add such a cool element. Visually. I guess the difference would be Vix had their fans. Uh, here we go with this. I forgot what they're called, those dancers. Wow. Yo. All that crazy floor work with that knee rock. Hands hello. We love them. Yeah, I guess the difference would be that Vix had fans the entire time. And that Kingdom's Karma, the female dancers had the fans, and it was only when they'd be part of the performance that they'd be there. And here they're going in and out of different props. Nice. Ooh! I like that level play there. Because they do the same thing, but they have the other dancers stay up. Really gorgeous dynamic. I thought they were going to stay, man. I was like... <laughs> I was like, I like how they did the first... I was going to say, I like how they did the first course by themselves, and then the second course they brought in the dancers, but for half of it. Oh, pretty. The hands were pretty there. Dance break, let's get into it. One of us have good dance breaks, though. I like the dance break music-wise, choreography-wise. Rotate. Looks like a double rotation. Nice. Yeah, well, they need rocket all day. Every day. And now we have these. I don't know what you call them. Sheer things? Chiffon. What is it? I don't know. Chiffon. It's not chiffon. Over their faces. Back to the fans. That was a nice ripple. Oh. Was that legit the fans that you heard? Not yeah, wow, okay, nice dance ASMR. And they have cool fans, the designs of them are gorgeous. That was nice. Gorgeous. Clean fan work if you want. I mean like, you hear if somebody was off. Oh here they come with the fans again. Pretty. They have cool fans. I love fan choreography. It's amazing, right? So, I mean, I'm comparing it to two other ones that I could think of that have fans in them. Um, really, really nice. Really enjoyed it and stuff. Um, well, I guess 
every time there's a fan choreography it, it has some traditional elements into it but anyways really enjoyed it. i think the choreography is great it's intense i love the dance break i love the dance break music wise and then also choreography wise brings the intensity i kind of do like that they go in and out of the props a little bit it's really really cool and it just heightens the fact of when they are dancing with the props it sort of elevates it because you see it without it versus say like vix's shangri-la um, even though that choreography is amazing and so they're dancing with fans the entire time so that's like a challenging part of it um, that they literally have the fans in their right hands the entire time and so it doesn't take away anything of just like how cool the fans are in that choreography but for this one it definitely enhances the moments when they dance with the fans more because they think you're seeing them dance without them for part of the choreography and stuff and it can get tricky too it well props are tricky and anyways it adds so much more difficulty to it um but <laughs> just in general when you add a prop um but you see them dance well i forgot lost my train of thought there when i started thinking about the difficulty of fans anyways um i did really like it though and stuff and again kingdom's karma they have the fan elements but it's the female dancers that use them when they're included in the performance um so like if you watch the dance practice for them there's you don't see the fan work but if you see the performance videos you see the fan work um and those ones had like a longer i don't know tails what do you call that i don't know um i don't know anything but just like the cloth the fans you know what i mean um the fabric on them was like longer than this one was but it has similar-esque effect not the same because what they're doing carpet was crazy and stuff but um i really liked it it was really nice and stuff i like the dance they some with the fans i'm like that's how you know somebody's off if you hear a little or a little or whatever <laughs> <laughs> Whatever the sound is, if you hear that off, you're like, hey, who was it? Um, but yeah, it was really gorgeous and stuff. The other dancers are killing, especially the male ones. Like, Jesus, they put in work. R.I.P. my knees. Couldn't be me knee rocking that many times. Uh, we all know not Megan the Stallion needs this. I, it probably hurts them too. Girl, I know how they feel. Um, but really enjoyed the choreography. It's gorgeous. It's nice. Uh, I, I feel like in terms of like the energy, I feel like it never died down and stuff. You have the beginning with the fans and stuff, but I feel like the choreography, um, it doesn't always go up because again, of course, it turns up with the dance break and then the outro. Um, but even when you do take the props away, it, I feel like it never dipped down and stuff. We were just very much, it felt very like consistent, which is very interesting that even when it is just the members themselves performing, that it still has that energy. That's kind of crazy and stuff because I feel like sometimes it can be like a dip down in energy because you're not seen as much visually. But it was, it, it was just consistently good, consistently great all the way around so i really enjoyed it. i thought it was great choreography is amazing love this comeback love wana so yes go to period thoughts and comment down below what do you thought about wana's luna dance practice if you like this video give this video a thumbs up if you liked me and want to see more of my videos go and hit that subscribe button if you want to see my videos the second they come out hit that notification button if you want to follow me on social media twitter instagram such as tiktok or description down below or at the end screen share this video to your friends thank you guys so so much for watching love you and i'll talk to you guys later bye gotcha.